Hey there everybody! You ever wonder how a company got started? Maybe how they make their money? How they grew to be the juggernauts of industry that they are today? Well look no further because today we're going to be breaking down the money behind YouTube. It all actually started way back in the beginning of 2005 located in San Bernardino, California. YouTube actually has a super interesting start. It was founded by three friends and former PayPal employees, Chad Hurley, Steve Chen, and Jawe Karim. Now YouTube grew to become the second largest search engine on the internet, right behind Google. But it didn't start out that way. It was actually started as an online video dating website. Now while this plan would eventually go on to fail, it laid the foundation for the future of the company. You see, one day all the founders were on a hunt for a video from the 2004 Super Bowl. A certain video featuring Justin Timberlake and Janet Jackson at the very end of their halftime performance, but they could not seem to find it anywhere. So they did what anybody would do and converted their dating website into a video sharing platform. Now you're probably wondering at this point, what was the very first video uploaded to YouTube? And you'd be good to wonder that my astute viewers. Why well, it was actually me at the zoo, which currently has over 156 million views. And yeah, I guess that's acceptable for an 18 second clip. From here, the three creators went to work. Chad Hurley was in charge of the look and design of the website since he had that fine arts degree. You had Stephen Chen who immigrated from Taiwan at only eight years old with his family with the tough job of making sure the website, you know, actually worked and you can upload the videos. Then you have German born Jawe Karim who had the task of programming and setting up the website. In early May of 2005, YouTube was seeing a crazy amount of views each day, 30,000. Now while you might go, Don, that's not so impressive, you have to realize it was started in February of 2005. Now give it another six month time skip into November and they were hitting over 2 million views a day and only going up, up, up from there. By March of 2006, YouTube had hit the 25 million daily views point with also hitting the crazy number of 20,000 uploads every single day. Now by the summer, they were the fastest growing website out there and by November, they got noticed by the big one. You know the one, it starts with a G. Can you say it with me? Google! Now Google tried making a YouTube look like called Google Video, but they were not able to get traffic like YouTube was. So Google did what they always do. They flexed those ultra deep pockets and just bought them for $1.65 billion worth of Google stock and took over the operations. No stopping operations. Fast forward to 2008 and YouTube had made arrangements with the likes of MGM, Lionsgate, and CBS. This allowed YouTube to host both movies and TV shows. Just two years later, they had added over 6,000 movies from a variety of companies. And by 2012, YouTube was up to roughly 60 hours of video being uploaded each and every minute. Also this year, YouTube had the very first 1 billion view video. I want you to take a guess of what you think it was and leave it in the comments down below. Have you guessed it right? That's right, it's the one, the only Open Gangnam Style. Nearly 10 years and billions of views later, YouTube is still growing by huge amounts every year. But now it's time for the all important question. How the heck do they make their money? And if you have ever seen a YouTube video, chances are that you, being the astute viewer that you are, already knows the answer. It's called ads. Early YouTube ads were actually voluntary and the user would have to click on the exclusive content. This was also done on a channel by channel basis. For example, Paris Hilton's YouTube channel had an ad for a Fox TV show. Around 2007, in-video ads had made their appearance, which soon evolved into pre-roll ads for 2008. Around this time also, YouTube began to actually pay its creators for the ads shown in the videos. This began to turn what was a hobby for many people into a full-time career as a creator. 
I make money from viral videos. Now with all these ads in the beginning, in the middle, in the other middle, and at the end of your video, how much money does YouTube get to rake in? Fun fact, these ads make up 90% of YouTube's revenue. YouTube targets these ads to 2 billion monthly users, and they share its ad revenue in a 45-55% split, favoring the content creators. The other 10% comes from subscriptions like premium. Premium users make up 20 million people, or about 1% of YouTube's monthly users. So uh, all you premium users out there, how's it feel to be in the 1%? But now it's time for the big number. With all those ads, YouTube makes $15 billion in yearly revenue. And a fun fact for free, this only makes up 10% of Google's revenue. Oh, that's a lot of money. So now that we know just how much money YouTube makes, did you know they also pay their creators a decent amount? The number of channels earning over $10,000 a year or more on YouTube grew by over 50% year over year. And during the same period of time, the number of channels earning over hundred grand per year grew by over 40%. YouTube users publish over 500 hours of content each and every minute, and over 1 billion hours of content is watched every single day. Do you want to watch more content? Because we have a whole lot of other videos on this channel. So be sure to like and subscribe for more. Once again, this is Dominic for The Financial Fixation, and I'll see you in the next one.